Hey, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Uh, this is Rekmar, also known as Matt by some people, but Rekmar is what you'll find me out on most things. Um, so this afternoon, I've decided I've got a bit of time, so it's afternoon over here in the UK at the moment, so I thought I'd put a deck together. And I found this card sitting in my collection that I didn't know I owned. So here's Gnostru, Voice of the Crags. Um, I've quickly thrown something together, which I hope works out. Um, basically, it's... A 3-3 from Commander Legends. Uh, tap it, choose one, X is number of spells I've cast this turn. Scry X, deals X damage to the target creature of my choice, or I gain X life. So, how am I going to do this? Well, we've got the ramp in, so Tantalite, Talisman, Crypt, Soul Ring. I went with the Bor the normal signets, um, so Azorius, Boris, and is it? Um put angel's grace in so i can you know don't lose the game if it looks like i'm about to and then i've got condemn path to exile um lightning helix for a bit of spot removal we've got doom scar over here with some big removal and a few other bits and pieces so uh flame tongues in here because i can't remember the last time i saw anyone play flame tongue and i fancied having it in my deck so it's here Battle of Frost and Fire, um, Prophetic Bolts of More Time, you know, removal, and then obviously Explosive Singularity. I've also, because um, Streets New Capenna is now available, I've chucked in Arcane Bombardment because I did a draft and I got one, so I was happy about that. And I've also dropped in Broker's Hideout and one of the other new lands. I can't remember the name off the top of my head. Uh, and I can't even see it now. Maybe it is only that one I've put in. Okay, it might be just be that one I've put in because it's the one I found for some reason. I have no idea why I haven't put the other ones in, but it's all good. Um, we've got a few creatures. We've got a few planeswalkers, Narsets in here, um, Teferi Timebenders in here, Tem Teferi Temporal Archmages in here. Um, we've got Agent of Treachery, Approach the Second Sons as a follow up, you know, secondary win condition, Elspeth's here. Few bits and pieces so we're going to go and jump in a queue i'm going to shut this down and we're going to go and see if we can find a game to join there's one we'll join that one quickly before anyone else gets there okay we're in so we've got archron moonkai pg a pg at 12 okay um and we'll see what we're up again so archon's got osgar the reconstructor up and running so that's the one from one of the recent sets, but I can't remember which one. Uh, I'm just looking at my starting hand. Um, so sacrifice an artifact, target, pay one second act, start an act, second act, uh, second act effect. That's good. Sacrifice an artifact, target creature you control gets plus two plus nothing to the end of turn. Oh, risk keeping this. Um, and then X tap, exile an artifact card, mana value X from your graveyard, create two carbon copies of exactly of that exiled card. So that's that. Um, oh, we have companions. So we've got Florian. Okay, so we've got a vampire deck, I'm guessing. Just go on to all the auto yields. Uh, at the beginning of your post combat main phase, look at the top X cards of your library, works as a total amount of life your opponents lost this turn. XR one of those cards. Oh, it's our turn. I didn't think we were here that quickly. Um, eh, we'll play the style. Haven't got anything to remove. Sure, it's fine. So. Yield until here. Right. Um, and then they're playing this with Obosh. Um, your starting deck only contains cards with odd mana values and land cards. If a source you control with an odd mana value would deal uh, uh, damage to a permanent player, it deals double it. So that's quite going to be quite interesting. And finally, over here, we've got a black partner pairing. Okay. So we've got Sengir the Dark Baron. Uh, whenever another creature dies, put two plus one plus one counters on Sengir the Dark Baron. Whenever a player loses the game, you gain life equal to the player's life total as the turn began. And then um, Tevash, Sat of Doom, Thrall tokens, sack them, gain control. Yeah, it's an interesting black pairing. So uh, Expedition match map has gone to get... something cabal stronghold okay so we are going for the mini mono black quick ramp over here okay we've got skirt prospector off of badlands from moon kai over here uh okay that's interesting i suppose it's mana ramp right and we draw 
next to nothing of any use. So we'll do this. We'll reveal this planes. We'll tap this and tap this. And we'll play a signal. Uh, and then we'll yield to here. Get up to four mana next turn. Um, oh, people are talking in the chat. I haven't done that. Apparently, that's bad of me. Potion of healing. Okay, I suppose it's a cheap artifact that we can sack off to our commander over here. Moonkai down with the mountain? Mountain, yes. Okay, Florian's out off the back of sacrificing our poor, sweet, innocent skirt prospect. I'm not quite sure why we didn't get attacked with it before we got sacrificed, but because as far as I remember, you don't need to attack. No, you just sacrifice a goblin. So we could have got him for one at someone. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I got no way of casting anything, so what we'll do is we'll drop the Fable Passage. Um, we'll go and find a second blue source. We've got blue mana for Dilation and Teferi at some stage that isn't reliant on this artifact still being in play. And we'll go on the Yield Plan because we've got nothing we can cast for three. So it's all good. Um, next turn, depending what happens this turn, we're probably going to drop Battle of Fire and Frost and Fire. I am a bit concerned that this thing's going to get silly at some stage. Um, okay, so Archron's gone with Faithless Looting. And he's discarded two mountains. So he's either overly indulgent in land or... Nope, there goes the healing potion. Not quite sure what's happening over there, to be honest. Don't think there's any need to sacrifice the healing potion. No, well, it might have been. I might have missed it. Uh, so, if it's just a message from my wife saying she's having fun with her horse. Right, where's Florian going? So I can't believe it's just going to sit there and do nothing. Oh, it's me. Okay. Not quite sure what I'm getting attacked, but oh well. I lost three life. So what does this do now? Exile one of those cards and put the rest on the bottom. You may play the exiled card this turn. I'm guessing they're hoping for a land. Does it tell us what they exiled? Ah, nope. Dragon's approach. Okay. Bauble goes and finds another land. Yep. I'm hoping that um, PG at 12 now casts a creature that has got a toughness less than 4. Yep. It's not targeting me, which is nice. I can't complain about that. Okay, our turn. Let's see what we draw first, in case we draw something better than what we... Uh, that's quite useful. And I've just played the wrong land, which was not what I meant to do. But never mind. We'll just drop Ionis. And we'll wait a turn for the Battle of Frost. My bad. Meant to drop the planes to cast this, but oh well, we'll take another bit of a beating. It's fine. It's 
It's interesting, Mooncar's just told us in the chat that most of his decks made up of sorceries. Oh well. Right, here comes the Reconstructor. Okay, I'm actually quite held up. I'm glad I held off on casting the um, Battle of Frost and Fire now then. I know I've got to get my commander in play at some stage before anyone says anything. I'm well aware of that fact. Being attacked again. I'm definitely wiping the board next turn. Six commander damage I've taken from that now. Uh, look at the top card your library. Exile one. Let's see what we'll gets exiled this time. Wheel of Fortune. If he casts that now, we're in trouble. Nope, going dark ritual into something. Well, at least we're getting not getting, getting Wheel of Fortune this turn, which is something I am happy about. Apparently, I'm getting Dragon's Approach, though. Oh, now we're getting Wheel of Fortune. Uh, which could have been better. I was going to put a grumpy message in the chat, but I'm not in that mood, so we're just going to carry on going with this. At least Moonkai's losing some life now. So, um... Yeah, we're going to cast Approach from the Second Sun. I don't see any reason not to. Puts us back up to 38. Unless we pull a Wrath effect. If we pull one of the Wraths, then we're Wrath of Godding. And if our friend over here is playing their commander, which one of their commanders are they playing? Tevesh? I'm guessing, yep. Yeah. Guess you can get some Thrall tokens, yep. Okay. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And a Blood Artist. Just what we always wanted. Oh, we didn't attack. I was waiting for take two of um, dear Gonti over here. But oh, that's interesting. All right, let's play the command beacon. We don't actually lose anything doing this now. To be fair, um, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, it's a zero effect thing. Let's make it back up with 38. See if we can last long enough to draw seven cards. Of course, as someone, it's not the way I wanted to win this game, but, um, you know, beggars can't be choosers, and I'll win whichever way I can, to be perfectly honest. I mean, if someone can find a way of milling my top six cards before my next turn. But, yeah. Mindstone from Archeron. Guess we're sacrificing it to make two copies. Nope. Two copies of the potion of healing. Oh, I'll be in the graveyard. Oh, it has. Okay. My bad. Didn't realize I had to be in the graveyard. 
you can stop sharing me in the YouTube minutes, notes, comments section. I'd imagine we've got several strikers approaches in here. We're eventually going to go and hit a big dragon. Would be my guess for Moon. Well, none of them are mine. <sighs> Another dragon's approach we take to the face. If it's down to thirty five. Apparently, I'm also known as Obesh, according to the um, in-game chat. I'm guessing I'll get hit again in a minute. I'm just asking um, Moon Carve up upset him in a previous life because I seem to be on the receiving end of all his damage at the moment. And now he's not talking to me now. I've asked a question. Everyone else has asked questions in the chat, so I haven't answered, but I haven't. So this may be a really short video. Okay, it's basically because I'm playing blue in my deck. Oh well. <sighs> and half to a soul comes out from PG at twelve. John, what are you doing, PG? Well, there goes Florian. Which I can't say I'm upset about. Though it does come she does come back next turn. Get drained for another one from the blood artist, I suppose. Mm -hmm. Went elsewhere, that's fine. Okay, let's see what we can get out this turn, shall we? Hmm. Uh, we'll keep Niv Mizzet, I think. Um...
Pardon me. Oh. Uh, white, blue, blue. Let's get our commander down. Since we're having an extra turn, might as well get it down. Drop some spells next turn and see if we can do some damage somewhere. Uh, no, okay. Get my extra turn. Heads or tails? We'll go heads again. Okay, that's three flips we're on with Manny Crypt. So this afternoon so far. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, twelve, six, seven, ten, twelve. Okay, we can cast everything. Okay, that's something. Come on. Right. So we're empty handed. Oh, hello. Archeon's gone. Don't know why Archeon's gone. It's just dropped out. Okay. Um, take one extra turn and people get upset with you. Uh, let's deal, let's have a scry. Uh, put on the bottom, put on the top, put on the bottom. Okay. Yield to here. Not quite sure why did you take an extra turn spell and people drop out. <laughs> I suspect we're all about to die to Obesh though, so I'm not particularly worried. The nice thing about this card in particular is it does give. No, where are they getting minutes from? Oh, sorry, yeah. Our owner's Guild of Victory does give all my creatures minutes, so it does make them really hard to block. Kind of just type me instead of my. Hmm. Need to work on my typing at the weekend. My typing at work all week. Hmm. hmm. Right. Let's see what Moon Kai's up to this turn. Oh. Oh, if you heard a click, that was my knee, not anything else, unfortunately. Let's see what's happening.
I didn't know how to reject them, but I can't remember. I do actually need to remember to um, keep the chat commands going. Uh, I actually need to favourite that. Sorry, just talking to myself while we're um, here. <laughs> Add, yeah. It's one of those things I probably should have set up so I have a list on my wall somewhere. But let's see what happens here. PGA 2012 still quite happy to... Um, Stay in play, so we'll stay in play then. Let's see how it goes. <laughs> As you can see in the chat, I put, well, I was recording this for my YouTube channel, but it's got a little pear shape, but we'll do it anyway. Ho, 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 decree of pain. Nice, okay. Yeah, nice. Nice, impressive, yeah. That means he gets loads of cards. I take one, two, three, four, five, six... Seven, maybe? Yeah, seven. I lose seven, he gains seven. <laughs> uh, Decree of Pain is one of those cards that you should really expect from a mono black deck, but I always forget about it. <laughs> I mean, he's just drawn... Oh... A huge amount of cards off that, which is quite impressive. Oh, I'm mas mashing my mic around with my hand. <laughs> uh, okay, so I'm off the top. I have got my commander I can easily replay, which is nice. Um, but Tevash is getting a little bit close to his minus 10 ability here. Um, I think from PG at 12, I would have attacked first before I cast the Greer Pain. I mean, I only had my commander and Niv in play. So it was unlikely. Yeah. Oh, well, lost the flip. This flip I've lost. I'm down to 19. This game is going to be over very quickly now, I feel. Uh, um, I'll have read off this then. That's fine. Uh Right, let's see what we can do here. All right, let's just tap that and play this. Let's get my commander back out. Uh, red. Blue. White. I'll do. We'll tap this out, just put charge counter on it. And um, yeah, we'll go from there. Not quite anywhere near this yet. One, two, three, four, five. Two off. Two off making my god a sh actual thing. Is he paying the four to untap his mana vault? That's the question. No, we're going to take the life point damage. I would imagine that um, PG at 12 is going to win this. Uh, it's been quite good fun, even if it's just us two. So we'll see what happens next. Small thralls. That puts Tevesh on 11, which is not good. Do you need to find a way to deal with Planeswalkers in this deck? Probably need some, some sort of Oblivion Ring effect, maybe. Um, it was along those lines, anyway. Sacrifice three creatures. Are we going to sack three creatures and transform our big vampire thing? Nope, I think we're just going to bury me under card advantage and kill me. Uh, Olary, we may spells, play spells that they had flash. Okay. Don't think we're getting through this one somehow, everybody. Oh, okay. Here's for sacrifice of three. Target opponent sacrifices three creatures. Wow. Didn't realize it was that one. Yep. 
back in the command zone. Oh dear, this game is over, isn't it? Hmm. Tech we zero one, go on. <laughs> We'll stick on heads. Oh, we won the flip. Yeah, you go. Let's see if we draw anything useful. Uh, that actually does help. <laughs> okay. So we have a condemn in hand. Uh, we'll just yield to here on his turn. Their turn. Her turn. The person's turn. Let's go with the person's turn. One day I'll remember to do this properly and call them people. Sorry if I've, if you ever watched this PG at 12 um, and I've just insulted you. Apologies from me. Okay, here comes something from the bauble. Not quite sure what we're doing now, to be honest. Breeding pit. Lots of creatures to create and sacrifice. Tevesh is up to 13. Paristone. You may sacrifice another. Yeah. I mean, the trouble is now this is sitting at 13. It's going to nick anything. Ah, uh, here we go. Bang. Well, Condemn deals with that for a turn. Ah, oh, the beginning of your instep create a thrill token. Yeah, fine. One auto yields and adds the breeding pit. Nope, plus the tables. Oh, I need some card draw or something. Ah, oh, we win. Uh, really sorry about that. I forgot we had that. Yeah, you know, it's coming. Not quite the way I wanted to win. <laughs> yeah fine have four cards from the top of my library you're not going to be able to kill me <laughs> um, PG at 12 you get the boat from me <laughs> I'm just letting our opponent know where we can watch the video. Okay, what did I put? Oh my giddy art. Look what he had left in his hand. Exsanguinate. Massacre Worm. Shell of Dread. Torment of Hailfire. And Torment of Desecrator. I really did like um, PG at 12's deck, I have to say. Um, that is definitely one of the most fun ones I've seen as a mono black deck. So, um, okay, that's a fairly short video. Didn't really do what we want to do with the game, but. We'll try it again at some other stage. So I hope you enjoyed watching this for half an hour to, to, in your time today. Um, please like, please subscribe. Um, if you want to see me live, I stream on a Tuesday night, Thursday night, and a Sunday afternoon at Rekmar, um one on Twitch. There'll be a link somewhere in this video some somehow, so you can click on that and come and see me. Come on, yeah. Please, yeah. 
not uh, you know people subscribing is nice but i just like followers really so go and have a look on twitch there's some old videos up there as well um hit the follow button um if you like what you see please feel free to subscribe all subscribers um get added into our discord channel um where we sit and talk about commander a lot of the time and put up random other things occasionally but it's mainly commander there are some drafting tips on there um as you can see from the youtube channel i do bits and pieces all the time so um but anyway thank you for watching this take care hope you enjoyed it i will probably replay another one of these games at some stage with this same deck um i might take out rise of the second sun though because that seems a little bit of a cheesy win but hey we won so um woohoo go me right um take care thanks for watching this see you all soon hopefully i'll see you in twitch chat take care bye